Morning guys, this is Eric at Macus. Still here at Shady Brook, and as you can see in the video, we're still pouring concrete into the foundation of this home. You know, as I sat here and watched these gentlemen work, something occurred to me, and I would like to argue that that concrete and cables and rod chairs are not the real foundation of this home. I think the real foundation of any project or any home is people. I'm gonna tell you a story. When me and my wife got married, we were very fortunate to be able to go to Fiji for our honeymoon, to a very distant island. And on this island, the main structure uh, had been there uh, for a long time. And we were told the story that around the base of each of the 12 main support beams of this structure, Fijian warriors vied for the privilege to be buried alive with their arms and legs wrapped around the base of each one of these uh, piers. They wanted to do this. Their structure, their foundation was people. Well, now I'm gonna tell you straight out, nobody at Macus is gonna volunteer to bury themselves in the concrete foundation of your home. But I still say the foundation is people the builder and the contractors that you choose to build your home. I'm very fortunate to work for Macus Homes. Eason Macus, my, my boss is the third generation of builder here in the South Lake Grapevine area. One of the gentlemen that you've seen out there working while I've been talking, he's working on his second decade with Macus Homes. Some of our staff are working on their third decade with Macus Homes. Many of our core contractors are well into their first, if not second decade of building homes with Macus. That sounds like a pretty strong foundation. You know, I'm gonna tell you the truth. We build in imperfect conditions, with imperfect materials, with imperfect people, and every one of us are imperfect. There will be mistakes. There will be things that go wrong in almost every project not just for us, but for any builder, commercial or residential. The question is, will they stand the test of time? Will they be there just like that concrete foundation? We need that concrete foundation to support the weight of that home and the family that lives into it for decades. So will you, who you choose to build your home stand the test of times? Come talk to us at Macus. We think we do. Yep. We're not going to bury anybody in your foundation, but we do believe that people and the working relationships between them are the foundation for any good home. This is Eric and Makus. Y'all take care now. Bye.